Hi, my name is Ivo. In this video I'm going to show you how to set up Volley Station to scout a simple drill and make a simple spreadsheet uh, for practice purposes. So the first thing, uh, go to the Seasons tab and create a new season uh, for just practices. I, al I already did that, so now I will go to the Teams tab. I will click Import and now you may select the SQ file or squad file that Volumetrix is providing you. So I will just go to this big folder. Uh, you need to find your conference, your team. I will pick up uh, University of Central Florida. Mm. And uh, yeah, after you import, uh, click on, a, on your team and go to the top right corner and press Edit Raster. And here what's useful to do is adding the positions. So, uh, Volley Station spreadsheets, uh, they work really good uh, when you have your positions filled out as it allows you to pull out the number of a player based on his position. So, uh, give uh, positions to your players. Uh, I'll just put it random. Uh, yeah, now we can press save. If there's any error, it's because, as you may see, uh, there is a there are duplicates in the player codes or numbers, and as we can see here, we have with number 16 we have a player named Sports Science Vert Info, so we may all delete that or like give it assign a different number. So I will give it 99. I will just press save. So uh, now we have a team. So now we want to start a new practice. So uh, press new match. Uh, select your season and now pick up your team so for one side and for the other one now we have to set up the lineup press set team and now you have to put here the starting six of your team uh, for practice purposes it's not really necessary so you may put just random players there uh, and it's not gonna change much so uh, you may use double click. When you double click, you put the players in the lineup. Uh, yeah, so let's make it like that. Let's put Seder in one for the other side. Yeah, like this, and we have Seder in in one. I press done, and now I put I choose start scouting. So now I will just add a video file here to show you uh, how you can uh, analyze a simple drill. So I will go to the correcting mode to make it, to make a video bigger. Now let me move my video. Uh, so uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm. I'm just going to scout a very simple, just the number of player of a server and number of receiver. Uh, and I'm just going to press enter and all the codes are, gonna, are going to be uh, posted here. I won't use any zones or any, any additional information, uh, just the number of player that's serving and the number of player that's receiving. So let me move a video a bit. Okay, let's go. Uh, how you may do that? Uh, so you may all decide that all servers are from the home team and all the receptions are from the second team. Uh, this is how I would recommend uh, using at the beginning. Later you may choose that the home team is going to be a team with a first setter and the away team is going to be the team with a second setter. So you just go. Uh, 
Yep. So uh, in this way, you may uh, you may scout your your uh, drill. That's very simple. Uh, what what you can do now and that's very interesting. If you would like to get more directions, you don't really need to type them while uh, coding. If if you are new to that, if you're advanced, you probably know what what you should do. Uh, but what you may do is when you go over the service, or you may go to the search window. We may uh, look for serves. As you see, we have a green highlight uh, marks here. So what you can do here is you may draw a line on the court of a service. So later the zone is going to be filled automatically. Yeah, so we may do that for uh, for everything. And as you see, the zones are going to change here. Uh, so now uh, let's assume that we made uh, we scouted uh, the drill like that, the very simple drill, and now we want to go to the spreadsheets and create a very simple sh a very simple sheet that is going to tell us what was the um, the reception uh, number for for your players.